What's going on guys, Beastly Gamer here, and this new video is about the Nintendo NX and its new capabilities. This thing, I believe, the Nintendo NX, this portable console hybrid device, is really going to change the game. There's lots of people out there now who are really deep into the mobile gaming foray. A lot of people play games on their phones and tablets all day long. Just look at what's going on with Pokemon Go. Even though it's a Nintendo property, it just goes to show how many people are invested in this mobile gaming foray. People are on their phones constantly playing games. I'm not one of them, but I do understand it. I believe maybe if I, if I had caught the rush 10 years ago when I was 25, I probably would have been just as crazy about these games as everybody else. But Nintendo isn't just stopping with the NX being this portable powerhouse that's going to be able to deliver console quality portable gaming that also converts into a console gaming device. It also has a uh, local multiplayer attached to the mobile device. It's also going to be able to play smartphone games. These games that everybody's going crazy over right now. I'll drop a link in the description. NX reportedly compatible with Nintendo's smartphone games. Nintendo's next console, codenamed NX, will reportedly support the company's own mobile games. According to the Wall Street Journal, quote, a person familiar with the matter, end quote, told the outlet that not only was the NX a hybrid device that functions as both a portable and home console, but it will also, quote, be compatible with its own smartphone games, end quote. Earlier this week, alleged details about the NX surface claiming the device will be a high-powered handheld that can plug into a TV docking station. It will also allegedly use cartridges, supporting prior rumors about Nintendo's plans to no longer use discs, and reportedly won't feature backwards compatibility. Nintendo NX is slated to launch in March 2017, and rumor has it that the console will be officially unveiled in September. So what does this mean? Uh, I don't know really much about Nintendo's mobile foray. I don't know exactly what they're doing when it comes to the phones and tablets. I know that Pokemon Go is a phenomenon. I don't know if it's a lightning in a bottle situation. It possibly could be. Or Nintendo could just start releasing hit after hit after hit. Who knows what happens when they release Mario on Android and iOS. It might be the biggest thing ever, right? Of course. What if they release something like Metroid? Or, you know, a Legend of Zelda game, a side story on iOS and Android. These type of games will also play on the Nintendo NX would be awesome. Now, I don't know if they're going to go to the full extent that Sony did when Sony released the PS Vita. I got the PlayStation Vita a week before everybody else. I got the early edition. And when they first announced the, the, the PS Vita, they had this cockamamie AT&T data plan that nobody wanted. That you could have invested in. It would give you data usage and you could use it anywhere. If Nintendo's going to do something like that, it might actually hurt this console more than anything else because that just put a, a horrible taste in the mouth of consumers. Uh, but I think that games that don't require data usage, you know, like games like Miitomo, whatever they come up with in Mario or Luigi, those type of games will work fine with the NX. But if they try to do things like Pokemon Go and have you walking down the street with your NX in your hand on some kind of data plan, it might actually backfire. But I think it's really awesome what they're doing with this console. I'm excited about it. I can't wait till September to see it. And uh, it's something that I'll definitely have here when it releases in March. You guys let me know what you think in the comments below. Do you think that the addition of the, the Nintendo smartphone games is a good thing for the Nintendo NX, adding more playability to this little handheld console hybrid? If you guys like the video, give a thumbs up, show support for the channel. It really, it really does help me out when you guys do that. If you would, share the video on your favorite social media sites, follow me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter, and tell everybody you know about me. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time. Let it go, pay my body call, take our bodies higher and higher.